My name is Alec, and I am nine years old. Today is my first day at elementary school in Japan. I don't speak much Japanese or know much about Japan yet, but I am really looking forward to my new school. My family got me the school bag and indoor shoes that I'll need to bring to elementary school. In Japan, you take your shoes off when you get home. And it's the same at school. When you get to school, you change into another pair of shoes at the entrance. The ones that you wear at school are indoor shoes. I introduced myself in Japanese. I had just learned what to say, and I couldn't speak very well, but everyone was really kind and welcomed me with applause. Every day, you will bring that day's textbooks and notebooks, as well as other school supplies, including writing materials, your contact book, and a cloth napkin for school lunch. On Mondays, you bring your PE uniform and indoor shoes, and if necessary, your freshly washed school lunch smock as well. This is because you must take your school lunch smock, PE uniform, and indoor shoes home on weekends to be washed. At elementary schools in Japan, each class is 45 minutes long. At junior high school, it is 50 minutes long. At elementary school, there is a recess between the second and third periods. At recess, some read books, talk with friends, or play. On my first day of school in Japan, all of my classmates gathered around me during recess. Everyone asked me lots of questions, but I didn't understand what they were saying. Everyone told me their names slowly, one by one. Yuma. Yuma. I really want to learn Japanese so that I can talk more with my classmates as soon as possible. After fourth period, we have lunch. The lunch servers pick up lunch from the school kitchen and then serve it in the classroom. Once everyone is ready, we all eat together. There were foods in the school lunch that I had never eaten before. But when I tried them, they were yummy. Please consult with the school if you are unable to eat certain foods due to allergies or for religious reasons or if you need to pray. After we finish lunch, it is cleaning time. We are divided into groups and are assigned a specific area to clean. Our group was assigned to clean the blackboard. It felt really good to clean up the places and things we used and make it all look really nice. 
The number of periods a day depends on grade level. Students in upper grade study for six periods every day. Today, our class had PE during fifth period. We change into our PE uniforms for this class. <laughs> Here I go! I still don't understand what everyone is saying, but I could tell from their smiles that they were excited and cheering for me. I was pleased to discover that we could understand each other's feelings even without words. Oh. I got a little scrape on my leg, so I went to the school infirmary. A teacher there will look after you if you get hurt or don't feel well. In upper grades, you move around to different classrooms for subjects like music, arts and crafts, and home economics. Ohayou gozaimasu! I started feeling a bit lonely. I thought that I could become better friends with everyone today, but unlike yesterday, it seemed like everyone was avoiding me. Arik! Oh. Arik, this is a present. Here you are. Everyone told me in English that there was a present for me. They had made me information cards about school life. I was so surprised. <gasps> Arigato! In the morning, everyone was secretly making those information cards to surprise me. I really want to learn Japanese as soon as possible so I can talk about anything with anyone. <laughs> I want to be able to do even more things with everyone today and tomorrow than I did yesterday. <laughs> <laughs>